As Christie's head of digital sales, Davis helped usher NFTs into the mainstream. They vowed to keep the project pure by not allowing any external brands to take over. So if you want to know more about this, then this video is for you. For today's video exclusive for NFT Nugget members, we are going to talk about the NFT expert Noah Davis who left Christie's to work for CryptoBunks. Christie's crypto connoisseur Noah Davis has announced that he'll be leaving the auction house to help usher NFTs or non-fungible tokens into mainstream art world to become brand lead of Yuga Labs, makers of one of the most recognized NFT projects, CryptoPunks. Noah Davis, head of digital assets sales at Christie's, who led the charge for NFTs into the art world, has left his job to work on CryptoPunks. The popular blockchain game is a major reason behind the boom of NFTs in the art world. CryptoPunks was recently bought by Yuga Labs, the corporation behind the Bored Ape Yacht Club NFT collection, and it is valued at $2 billion. I am humbled and honored to announce I will be leaving my current post in July to steward the CryptoPunks as brand lead under the umbrella of at Yuga Labs. David wrote at July 19, and the statement was followed by a promise to keep the punks punk, which means there will be no frivolous marketing or commercial deals that end with the crypto punks on lunchboxes or cringe TV shows while Davis is in charge. He wrote, Davis helped bring NFTs out of the metaverse and onto the auction house floor with the sale of Beeple's digital work every day in the first 5,000 days 2021 last March. The sale marked the first time Christie's accepted cryptocurrency for a work and the first time a standalone NFT was sold by an auction house. After 353 bids were placed by 33 bidders, some of which were raising the price in $10 million increments. Everydays sold for a mind-numbing $60.25 million, $69.3 million with fees, and the former head of Christie's Auction House will be able to meet up with his old company with the help of crypto collectibles that are being auctioned by Christie's. Having first begun at Christie's in 2014, Davis has recently become a major influencer in the NFT space, building a large following and creating his own NFT project called Holers. Christie's warmly congratulates Noah Davis on his new role as brand lead for Yuga Labs. The auction house said in a statement, Noah has been a dedicated colleague and senior member of the Christie's 20th and 21st century art specialist department and has played a valuable role in establishing our leadership in the NFT and digital art space. We look forward to continuing to work with Noah in his new role. In his Twitter thread announcing his new job, Davis outlined his plans for crypto punks. I will not fuck with the punks, he wrote. What does that mean? It means no punks on lunch boxes or cringe TV shows or shitty movies. It means no arbitrary rushed utility or thoughtless airdrops. It means if you love your punk punks because they're what they are, just punks, and then you and I see eye to eye. Davis, the collector, says that how to preserve the collection will be based on the community's opinion. MSTs, short for non-fungible tokens, are blockchain-based virtual items. Noah Davis is telling us the investment founder that he will stop his tenure with NFT sales to benefit the Multidisciplinary Association for Psychedelic Studies. With that, let us learn more about CryptoPunks. 10,000 unique collectible characters with proof of ownership stored on the Ethereum blockchain. The project that inspired the crypto art movement, selected press and appearances include Mashable, CNBC, the Financial Times, Bloomberg, Market Watch, The Paris Review, Salon, The Outline, Breaker Mag, Christie's of London, and Art Basel. 
In 2018 and 2021 articles were published in the New York Times. The CryptoPunks are one of the earliest examples of a non-fungible token on Ethereum and were inspiration for the ERC721 standard that powers most digital art and collectibles. The CryptoPunks are digital, unique characters generated on the Ethereum blockchain. There are 10,000 of them and each one can be single-handedly owned. Originally, they could be claimed for free by anybody with an Ethereum wallet, but all 10,000 were quickly claimed. Now they must be purchased from someone via the marketplace that's also embedded into the blockchain. Via this market, you can buy, bid on, and offer punks for sale. CryptoPunks is a collection of 24 by 24 pixel art images generated algorithmically. Most are punk-looking guys and girls, but there are a few rarer types mixed in. Apes, zombies, and even an alien. Every punk has their own profile page showing attributes as well as their ownership or for sale status. There you have our NFT nugget video for today. So what do you think of this new issue that is circulating right now? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, click the notification bell, and like this video. If you think that we have delivered value, please share this video with one person. Just one share is enough for us, for you to show your appreciation for the commitment and hard work we all put together in creating this video that teaches and helps you on your mission of building your own fortune. And you don't know, the one share could go a long way. Keep in mind that no matter how many times you're going to watch this video, you won't see any results unless you take action. Goodbye and see you at the next one.